So hey everyone, I hope uh, y'all are doing well. I got some packages. These are just um, parts for my generator. So I have a pet cock here in this bag. And because my pet cock was what was messed up on my generator during the ice storm, preventing my generator from working. And uh, I just went ahead and bought, and there's a new fuel filter in here and a carburetor, spark plug, and a couple of other items, wires in uh, the new little fuel thing there. So uh, sometime within the next couple of weeks, I have to fix the generator, <laughs> which is where YouTube comes in super handy because you get to learn how to do it. In fact, it was from YouTube that I learned what parts I needed to order or I learned where to get them from. That had to come from eBay because Amazon did not sell the parts for my generator. And I think the petcock came from Amazon. But over yonder, I got a package today that I'm kind of excited about. So let's put it on the table. So what do you suppose could be in this box? Something that you normally would not expect me to order, but I've been under so much stress, as you know, within the past several months. And um, I saw this one day on YouTube and I thought, you know, that is really nice. I really, really liked it. And I kind of thought about it, thought about it, thought about it. And then one came on sale. So I ordered it. Alrighty, so what'd we get? We got this stuff. Okay, <laughs> this is so, so not like me, but I'm going to learn. I am going to learn. A steel tongue drum. I'm excited. Oh, and uh, what is this? There's also uh, another box in here. Oh, okay. That is a cooking thermometer. Actually, I will um, be taking my mini fridge out of the motorhome. It's electric and I need something 12 volt. So, and I have a Coleman 12 volt cooler, it, but it does not have a compressor. It does cool foods down, but I wanted to get this to keep an eye on the temperatures. And it, there's two prongs, and I have two coolers. So I thought I would test them. I'll do that in a few days. Put them through a test and see how cool they actually get. Now, ta-da! Let's open this. Oh, awesome, awesome, awesome. Put the knife away. And put the scissors away. Oops. Okay, so what is in the package? This cute little box. Dang it, I'm sorry, I keep bumping the camera. I'm hooking it on myself. A nice little bag there. Let me lower the camera. So there we go. Steel tongue drum, made in China. Of course, I think almost all of them are. Let's open up this first.
made by Aklot, A-K-L-O-T. Of course, the mowers show up. <laughs> Isn't she pretty? That's a nice carrying case, by the way, that I just threw aside. And in the pretty little box, see how pretty it is? Our little finger things that you play the drum with. You put them on your fingers and play the drum. I have a little mallet holder. And you have the mallets. Oh, and you get extra stickers because those will wear off. Once you learn them, I don't suppose you need them, but while you're learning it, yes, you probably need those numbers. Okay, let me get the little mallet thingies. Come on. Come out to the bag. Jeez. Hold on. It's a nice little drum. It was on sale. So I grabbed it. I've been kind of researching them a little bit and studying them a little bit. And of course, I'm not a musician by any means. I don't even know, know how to read notes, actually. But uh, I was listening to them, watching videos of them. And I chose the one that I liked the sound of for a price range that I could afford. I'm gonna wait, hold on. Well, we'll put this on and then uh, we'll play with this as soon as the mower leaves. Anyhow, the case is padded. Not thickly, but it is padded. And it has a carry strap with it. And you also get this little booklet, a little music book which, uh, from what I understand, is pretty much gives you little rhymes that you know as a kid. Shows you how to put the stickers on correctly. This is the one I got right here. And, uh, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, <laughs> told you. <laughs> White Washer, don't know that. Little Bee. Don't know that. Rice shop, school song. That'll be fun. I'll just keep playing with it. Looking for friends. Little donkey. <laughs> Sorry, I can hardly say it. Little rabbit lambkin. Three little bears. <laughs> Mary had a little lamb. I went to kindergarten. <laughs> Throw a handkerchief. Magic flute. Little Red Riding Hood. Wash handkerchief. Ah, oh, something about handkerchiefs. Got a thing going here. Counting duck song. <laughs> so, yeah, maybe I'll learn how to play those. I dropped the mallet. Here we go. So, let's see how it sounds. And yeah, this little thing is to hold the mallets so they don't roll off your table because I didn't do that and it rolled off the table. And again, I don't know what I'm doing here, so. Oh my gosh. That sounds beautiful. Oh my gosh, I needed this so bad. video out there. <laughs> Didn't that sound nice? Oh, I needed this so bad. I've got some other news, but I can't talk about it yet. 
So I will be telling you all about that one later. This is going to be great for traveling. Okay, I had to wait till the mowers were done. You can strike it with your fingers too, but there's a technique to it. Sounds much better with the mallets. Let's try the little finger things. Oh, I guess it has to be down at the bottom. I'm <laughs> putting them at the top of the fingers. I probably can't get the same kind of strike with it. Yeah, I'll be playing with the mallets anyhow. That's a... Okay, it doesn't fit on broken fingers really well.